hello guys welcome to my channel in today's video we want to learn how to make SLES which is tezapon in making tezapon we need a bowl we also need whiskers the chemicals we need are sodium sulfate and SLS powder then we need water. Here I have two liters of water. We are going to pour one liter into the major bowl and keep one liter aside. Then we are going to measure sodium sulfate. I've weighed this before about 120 grams of sodium sulfate. We dissolve it in that quantity of water which is one liter you stir it very well until everything is completely dissolved stir it very well some people use hot water or warm water but this is just water at normal room temperature so you can see that it's completely dissolved set this bowl aside and then take the second half which is another liter of water we are going to measure into this bowl of water 130 grams of sls sls powder not sls rice and then we are going to also stir very well until it starts foaming stir it very very well you continue to stir vigorously if you have a mixing machine at this point it will be helpful but if not you keep stirring until it starts foaming to ensure that all the particles are completely dissolved stir it very well I say it all the time in production where you don't have mixer, stirring is very very important. So you can see that it's well dissolved and it has started foaming. We are going to turn it into the main bowl, the bowl that is containing our sodium sulfate. So you turn the SLS powder mixed in water into it and stir. Watch the reaction very interesting production is fun i tell you i enjoy what i'm doing stir it very very well keep stirring and you notice that it's getting thicker as you are stirring as you are stirring the reaction is taking place and it's getting thicker you just keep stirring Stirring so that it will mix up completely. It will mix up completely. Very good. Very, very good. So, you know, after mixing it up completely, we are going to allow it to rest for one hour before we stir it again. The better, the more you stir, the better the texture of your text apple. When it's properly mixed together, your desert pond will come out very, very nice. So, you leave the mixture and after one hour, you stir again. You can see it now. After one hour, you stir again. Stir it very well. When you notice that the consistency is light, you can actually thicken with salt table salt, normal table salt. You can make it thicker by adding your normal table salt. You just add little by little and stir until you get the viscosity that you desire. So you can thicken your SLS, SLES with salt. I've added some salt already and you can see that it's becoming thicker. You can add until you get the real texture that you are looking for, the viscosity that you are looking for. I think this is just fine. 
your face tearing and you are going to leave it again for some hours. Some people will teach that you can leave it overnight for 24 hours. But I think what is important is just leaving it until the foam goes down. This foamy part of it has to go down. So it depends on how long it takes for the foam to go down. I left mine for about four hours. And now look at what I have. My Dexapon is ready. Beautiful, thick, and very, very attractive. Now you can use this Dexapon to make just anything like shampoo, like your shower gel, like your liquid soap, dishwash, so you can use it. Have you subscribed to my channel before? Please, if not, please subscribe, like this video, and share it to your friends. And I like to hear from you. It's one of you that said I should make this video on how to make this a point. Here is the video, sweetheart. Thanks for that recommendation. God bless you for watching. Please subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next video.